Hey guys, Nikki here, and today we have a full dedicated video on one of my favorite hair companies, My First Wig, so let's get into it. Alright guys, let's hop straight into the package in my first week, Quality Weeks for Beginners. This company is not a stranger to my channel. I'm literally one of the first people to ever review for this company and I absolutely love them. They focus on beginner friendly wigs for people who don't really know how to apply wigs. So let's go over everything that's in the box. There's a brochure in here with how you put the wig on and etc. There's a bag that is full of goodies. There are clips to clip your hair back and you will also get a rat tail comb in this bag and I love the bag because you can keep it and store stuff in. So the comb has my first wig on it right there with a rat tail at the end which we all love and it is a great quality heat resistant comb so let's go into the inside this is 20 inches it's silky the hair color is natural the cap size is right there it's a 13 by 6 lace front and the density is 130 so you will get wig caps i love this color of the wig caps right here even though i don't wear them because i think wig caps be taking my edges out y'all so anyway this is the wig right here there is lace but it is pre-cut the lace is really not going to show but right there at the top but this is a very scalp like part so this is the hair it is pre curled it is beautiful beautiful Indian hair guys so let's talk about the inside there are two combs on the side there is a comb at the back and there is an adjustable strap in this wig if you would like to adjust that there is also a strap in here to wear it glueless that snaps all you do is snap the ties in and boom you have it right there makes it fit good and secure on your head so let's just hop into the install Whoop yeah let's do it so i already have the wig on and let's just put it back so we can adjust it i always just put it on first to see what we are working with this is a curtain bang style wig this wig is very hot and very trendy that's why i wanted to try it and i'm gonna go back and forth with it a little bit and it's gonna turn out to be more like a layered looking wig on me but we'll talk about that later but it is a gorgeous wig so i'm just adjusting it on my head making sure that everything is straight making sure that part is in the middle and we're going to just tie everything up per usual after adjusting it so i can see exactly what i want to do with the wig no matter what type of wig i have to tie it up and see what i'm working with i love the bang wigs from my first wig but it's usually like straight bang wigs so i've never worked with curtain bangs so we're just gonna make it do what it do so like i said i'm tying it up right here i'm just using a regular clip and then what i'm gonna do is move all of this hair out of the way which you really don't have to do i could have just put foundation on the lace to make this easier and just put it straight on like this but i want this to stay down a minute so i am gonna spray it down so what i'm gonna do is just take a edge band to hold all of this hair back so we can get to working honey so i made that super difficult and i could have used the clips that they provided but i just didn't think to grab them like what you know how you're stuck in your habits so this is the even spray right here i'm just going to spray along the perimeters i'm only really concerned with the like top portion by the um part because the sides aren't really going to show because i'm not going to wear it up or anything but i am going to put spray right there and blow dry it down so that the wig will stick to my head so that's what i'm doing i'm using a dryer all of the hair products that i use is always listed under the video in my amazon store so i'm going to take that same band and just pull it down so that it can adhere the head to my the wig to my head that's what you see me doing right here so boom let's go into the next step we're going to take it off now because everything is good and dry and i am going to take a bronzer and just go around the lace since i didn't color the inside of it so that when you take your pictures and etc especially with flash there won't be a flashback where the lace is at just go around the perimeters of your head with your foundation or your bronzing powder so now I'm going to take it down so I can see exactly what I'm working with. The part is kind of all over the place, so I'm going to make it straight. You can keep it like that, but I'm going to take my wax stick. And I always do this just so I can see exactly what I'm working with. It just makes some things so much easier on me. Then I brush stuff out the way. 
And I am going to go back in and adjust that part a little bit. So the part is adjusted. Let's move on into it. I am going to take my foundation powder and just bring out the part a little bit more. Although the part is not the focal point because this is more of a bang style wig. You guys know I just like things to look as neat as possible. So I'm just going to take an eyeliner brush and go over that part really, really quick. So now I always take my flat iron. It has a hot comb on the end of it and do the same step just to brush everything out the way so I can see exactly what I'm working with. It might be a lot of tedious steps to you guys, but it really makes a difference. So boom, we're just going to brush the curls in it that came with it because it is gorgeous. Like it's falling perfectly. It has body. It's a beautiful, beautiful luster to it. And you don't need to go back in and curl it. Look, the curls are falling gorgeous. Just separate them a little bit, comb through them, and let's work on the bangs. So... The curtain bang style is really a very hard style to maintain. So I'm just going to show you guys and do it the easiest way that I know of. You just do it or curl it or bump it like you're wearing regular bangs and just let it fall back. I don't like to cut the bangs or anything on a wig. You guys should know that if you have watched any of my other My First Wig reviews, I just pull it back and let the wig do what it do because when I get to cutting... I am so scared I'm going to mess something up, so I just don't even do it. I don't even do it. I'm putting a bump in here, not an actual curl, and I'm just going to play with it. You can make this fall more in your face, but I'm really one of those people who are annoyed with stuff batting up against my eyelashes. So when I have bangs, I have to cut them before the lash so that it don't do that. So I'm showing you how to wear it where you still have that curtain bang effect, but it's not like directly in your face. So I'm just steady bumping this to give me the look that I want. And this is some gorgeous hair, guys. So, you know, I would definitely recommend my first wig. If this is not your cup of tea, they have so many beginner friendly wigs on their website for you to choose from. I highly recommend their bang wigs. I absolutely love, 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 love their bang wigs, okay? And they are just a really great sight. There is no shedding. There is no anything with this wig. It is very user friendly. They have split and quad pay options. If you don't want to pay for your wig all up front, we love a budget, honey. I put anything on split pay, okay? And they are just a super great company. So I will leave the direct link to this wig below along with a discount code, a link to the website, of course, and some more very important information below the video. Check them out. And I really do think you guys need this in your stash. Once again, thank you so much, My First Wig, for sponsoring this video for me. And I really do think you guys should add this wig to your stash. It's a banger, it's a banger, and you need it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.